Hi everyone, I'm Sonia and the next sequence I'm going to share with you is a wonderful sequence of poses that you can use to help get into the splits or Hanumanasana. So if this is something that you're working towards, these poses are key and you need to stay in these poses for at least one to two minutes. But for the purpose of this demo, I'm only going to stay in them for two to three breaths. So I've also been able to give you a bird's eye view of the sequence, so I hope you find that helpful. Let's get to it. So coming all the way up into a standing forward bend, allow the head to be heavy, allow the whole body to relax to the ground, grab hold of the elbows and melt down. Lift the sitting bones up to the sky, feel the stretch in the back of the leg, stay here for one minute. For now I'll demo these, but you when you're practicing the series will stay in them for one minute. The next pose is Pajvottanasana, intense forward stretch, where you step your right foot forward and allow your body to eventually melt so that it's lying across that front leg. One minute in this pose. Then you'll move from this pose into a low lunge. Take the hands up above the head, hook the thumbs, reach up, open the heart, really just sinking into this. One minute. So every pose you go into, you'll stay in there for one minute. And then you'll take your hands down to the ground and sink down into a deep forward bend. Just drop your head, allow your body to relax. After one minute, move into a dragon pose where you take the foot out to the side, let the knee drop out, and you can either be on the hands or you can melt down onto the elbows. Just total relaxation really feeling through the hip flexors one minute and then when you're done with that you're going to pull back bring the toes towards the body push the heel away and start to melt the body over that front leg back knee obviously bent into the ground one minute here so a total of five minutes on each side melting the body before attempting to move into the Hanumanasana or the splits. Beautiful. And then once you're here and you begin to feel comfortable, just hook your thumbs together and reach the body up. And then you're going to start to melt the body forward. So taking the hands to the ground, sliding the hands forward, and then melting the body over that leg and stay here for some time if you can just breathing breathing the back body alive breathing the back of the leg and then after a minute come up and you can play here as well just taking hold of the back foot really stretching through the quadriceps or the stomach and spleen meridian and just using the foot to push in the hands and open the heart and then you can deepen that by just taking the foot and just folding it into the tailbone so obviously this depends on where you are at the moment with your practice or what's available to your skeleton. But these things are great if this is available and it feels really, really good. And we can restore and regain our flexibility at any time, but it does take daily practice. All right, come back up. Just melt down into neutral, standing forward bend. Deep breaths and then switch side. Remember one minute in each pose. So first, one minute in intense forward stretch. Left foot forward, body melts over. Then you're going to slide that foot back and come into a low lunge with the knee to the ground, lifting the hands up, sinking into it, one minute. Then you'll take the hands down to the ground, relax, and sinking even deeper, one minute. and then into your dragon foot comes out to the side knee drops out you can stay on the hands or you can melt down onto the elbows really just feel like the whole body is beginning to melt into this pose this is the essence of the series relaxing into it and then you're going to come into your hamstring stretch toes come towards you heel pushes away one minute body folds over the leg and then after that, you should be ready to slide into the splits, Hanumanasana. And then you can play again. Fold over the leg. Feel the deep intensity there. Keep breathing. 
and then once that is done grab hold of the foot pull back lift up the heart lift up the chest and then tuck that foot into the tail lifting up again this is a deeply relaxing series I hope you enjoy it and keep practicing stay healthy stay beautiful well done so I hope you feel amazing and you found that sequence helpful. If you did, remember to join the family, like, and leave any comments or questions that you might have in the comment box and I will try to get back to you uh, as soon as I can. Alright, so thank you everybody and Namaste.